And hello there, we're back. And I'm here too. And this is the next part to our Let's Play of, of the Subspace, the Subspace Emissary. Emissary. Wow, that was such a noobish intro. Very much so. I'm so much better than that. And you are too. But well, anyway. that could be comedy-ish. Yeah, anyway, what time are we shooting for? We're at like 25 minutes now, so... Alright, as long as we finish before this reaches 40, we're good. Yes, you all know how our recording session is going now, but you can do the math. We're probably not going to be cutting much anyway, so it shouldn't be hard to do the math for how long we've been recording. I don't know if we'll do the whole game in one sitting. Probably not. We'll probably actually stop after this, won't we? Uh, we'll have to do two, so we can get a nice, rounded, close to 15 minutes increment, you know? Yeah, I mean, like, after this session, or this last, you know what I mean. After we've reached our 15 minutes. Right. Or finish the level with, and then left without enough time to finish another one. That's kind of how it works. The levels aren't long, except for the Great Maze, which is very long. Yes, very long indeed. Unnecessary wall blocks is unnecessary. And the Boroboros, or whatever he's called. Well, that chicken just kind of, you know... Darn it, I need it to be Mario. Why? Because there's that door you can't get to with Pit in this level. The one you have to wall jump? Yeah. I can try. Yeah, but my camera doesn't follow right. you. Ooh, little Mac. Got it. I love little Mac. I love Punch Out. Have you played Punch Out Wii yet? No. I have it, you should. Okay. It's really fun. And the final boss is Donkey Kong, spoiler alert. You know, you're supposed to do your spoilers alerts before, aren't you? Crap. So close. And yet, so far away! Oh my gosh, these guys gotta die first, though. I don't like that, because when you try to... You know, once you start flying... You stop slightly. I'm no good at this. You I made it! Sweet. Yeah, you have to get up there anyway, because you're player one. Player two can't. You know? Yeah. CD. How close are you to all the music? Very. Um, who needs it more? Well, doesn't matter now. Haha. Uh -huh. Aww. It's okay. I got a CD. That's probably one of those CDs that, like, the only way to get it is to get the CD, and it's always there, you know? Yeah. Which is good. I'm glad I got it. Well then. And this is gonna start moving. Um, extremely stationary shield, anyway. Aperture Science unstationary scaffold. My favorite Aperture Science item, besides the device. What about the weighted companion cube? Well, that's everyone's favorite, that's inevitable. I mean, come on, it'll never threaten to stab you. Would, or, wouldn't you like to have a friend who will never threaten to stab you? I would hope that would be all of my friends. They're not really my friends if they're threatening to stab me, I would hope. What if they shank you? I'm going to shank you in prison. Okay. Cool! Ganon's right about everything! Your face! I will make your face die! My face? Your face? Will die. Die! Fudgy wudgy. Yay, you did it too. I don't feel so alone. Well, I don't like saying the F bomb. Cheery poop. Okay, John. That's gonna be made fun of forever, and I don't even remember which video it was in. Oh, Sherry. You know you can have that, right? Not until I get rid of my hammer. Bang, bang, Maxwell's silver hammer came down upon her head. Okay, Beatles. I'm not sure which one sang that song. Paul. Okay, Paul McCartney. John Lennon hated that song. Why? Because it was one of, quote, Paul's granny songs. It's not a granny song. I don't think a granny would sing about killing people with a hammer. Most grannies sing about baking cookies for the grandchildren. That's, okay. I don't think anyone's grandmother actually sounds like that. Well, if your grandmother sounds like that, leave your inter interesting response in the comment section below. Hello. But thanks for watching this episode of Let's Play Subspace Emissary. Okay, never mind. You know what? Let's not be Ray William Johnson. Yeah. We're going to end up on Retsu Play now. Retsu Prey. Retsu Prey? Yes.
It's supposed to be a bad, stereotypical Chinese accent. Red Supre. Hello and welcome to Red Supre. Sorry. Was there actually some guy? Wouldn't it be funny? I'm not. <gasps> Saturn. Goombella. Lamest party member in Thousand Year Door, but still. Whatever.